um, you can't handle the truth, and hello gorgeous in reverse. Let me check. Ooh. <clears throat> and then we have some birds are aren't meant to be caged. Their feathers are too bright. And I will not be intimidated. So the overall energy is, is you're speaking out about the truth about something. You're shining really brightly and you will not be intimidated. So you are definitely like standing up and maybe you're even queen of swords or king of swords energy. Hello, gorgeous. Someone did not see your beauty. They overlooked you for some reason. Oh, well, I guess that's their bad, huh? <laughs> but somebody... I feel like somebody is admiring you from afar. <clears throat> Empress energy or emperor, take it out, resonates. Something is ending. Let me get a few more cards here. So something is ending for a king of wands. <clears throat> this is someone who is not a leader, someone who is um, kind of in their player energy. Um, you're starting a new cycle. Someone may have tried to keep you bound to a situation, but you are being set free from a situation. Yeah, this is this is a situation in reverse. Uh, oh man, these last three, <laughs> they're all in reverse. <clears throat> So someone wanted to cause you a betrayal. So someone betrayed you in the past and they wanted to have you in poverty. They wanted to do something to affect your finances and they put you in a situation. And you have someone coming towards you, the Knight of Swords and the Upright. You have someone coming towards you with some sort of truth. Okay. Someone wants to come tell you the truth about something. <clears throat> I'm sorry, guys. I am really flimmy still. The weather change has got me all screwed up. Someone has made a decision about you. Um, they want to heal a situation with you. They see that you um, are healthy. You are healed. You, um, oh, they may have, they may think that you're ready for a relationship is what I'm getting. Oh, Someone was trying to keep you stuck. That's the hangman in reverse. Um, you are seen as being held in high honor. Someone was trying to stop you from getting an offer in the past. And the king of wands came out in reverse. So the king of wands could have stopped you or been trying to stop you from getting an offer in the past. But you're moving on to calmer waters. Someone wanted to cause you heartbreak. And you are dealing with a lot of conflict at this time. You are having to set um put out not set a lot of fires you are putting out you're having to put out a lot of fires this is the five of wands energy in the upright so you could be um dealing with a lot of conflict at this moment <coughs> i've been holding off busting out my inhaler i try to let my body heal itself but i may have to hit my inhaler <laughs> I have been holding off. <clears throat> okay, so, so far, we have someone that can't travel towards you, um, setting the table. Someone can't come towards you, but they're getting ready to. Setting the table is the last word on there. So someone can't come towards you, but they're getting ready to. Someone is preparing to come towards you. This is a masculine energy. Um, and they're afraid of something. Someone wants to come towards you and they're getting ready to, but they may be afraid of something. There's a lot of talk going on. So this person may be afraid of what people will think if they come towards you. Oh, that sucks. You shouldn't listen to other people's opinions.
this could be somebody that, that you cut ties with ice cube someone might feel this could be this masculine energy could be somebody that you cut ties with and they might feel like if they come towards you you might be cold towards them oh. i find that very interesting let's learn some more i like to get educated Someone could miss your cooking, or you could be a good chef. You could be a good cook. Um, ooh, the very last word that caught my eye, candy cane. Someone thinks you're sweet. Oh, you could be a chef. You could know how to cook, or this divine masculine um, could know how to cook. Someone could be eating a lot of soup at this time, or um, uh, just um, maybe watching what you're eating, eating lightly. I, I get the energy of somebody eating lightly at this time. Okay, so I get a masculine energy that's shitting a brick, but it's not in a bad way. But someone is just shocked. I'm getting shocked. <clears throat> There's a masculine energy that's kind of shocked right now. <laughs> I don't know what you did, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine, but someone is shocked. Um, <clears throat> someone tried to stop you from elevating... Um, beating eggs, changing a diaper. So someone's acting like a baby. They were they were trying to stop you from elevating and moving um you know into what your true calling was someone uh, bouncing a ball someone wants to play with you and gargle someone's getting ready coffee pot coffee could be significant to somebody i know i like my coffee what up just saying just throwing that out there <laughs> but someone could be wanting to play I, I just feel like someone wants to play with you and this is like in a good way and not in a bad way which is really crazy because usually you know that's a bad thing but this is a good thing someone wants to play with you in a good way Ooh. and someone is crying someone is crying because they feel like they missed a goal cleaning their eyeglasses in reverse so someone didn't see you they didn't see your worth they <laughs> grooming a horse um is the last word so somebody oh my gosh somebody was um moving quickly somebody moved quickly towards somebody else and they thought they scored a goal but that's the opposite of what happened somebody missed the boat on that one somebody is in a huge state of regret and they're crying right now someone is crying because someone wants to come play with you <clears throat> And this is not meant for kids. Okay, this is definitely not meant for kids. But somebody wants to come play with you adults. <laughs> In a very adult way, if you catch my drift. You are in your boss energy, Queen of Wands. You're seen as a leader. Um, you're in your boss energy right now. And something has been brought to light. And this masculine is seeing you in a whole different light. Someone didn't think you were going to be able to heal from something. Someone is shocked. Someone cannot believe that you were able to heal from something. Something that was meant to destroy you. Wow. Someone is in complete awe. I'm just getting like they are just in complete awe of you. I mean, they're just shocked. So I don't know what you guys did, but somebody wants to be your king of cups. And this could be a Pisces sign. It could be a water sign. Take it how it resonates. But this person is like business oriented. Um, in the reverse, they can be um, emotionally unsteady. But this man is upright. So this man is in control of his emotions. So that's a good thing. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, you're king of wands. Or not your king of wands, your king of cups has a big wand for you. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. I I I got it. I got it. I got it. So there's a king of wands who wants to or not a, I keep saying that. A king of cups. There's a king of cups who wants to give his big wand to you. Oh my god. I told you someone wanted to play with you. I told you. Someone wants to give you their big wand. Oh my god. I cannot help laughing. Oh my gosh. This is just so dirty. It's so dirty already. Oh my gosh. There is a feminine 
And if I'm feminine out there, and this is a collective reading, not a personal reading, so you, you know, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. You could be on either side of this, that, you know, if you're the masculine watching this, you could be wanting to give your wand to some female, but there's a female that a, a masculine energy wants to give their wand to. Oh my god, this is no joke! Two of cups, this is no shit! Oh my gosh! Oh my god, someone wanted to keep you indecisive so you wouldn't make the right choice, but there's someone who wants to... <laughs> I can't help it, someone wants to give their big wand to you. Oh my god, I cannot. Oh my gosh. So you may be in a situation right now that you are having to recover from. You know, three of your cups have been knocked over, but... I love this card because it makes me feel like you're special. Because, you know, they can take the physical stuff, they can take the outside stuff, you know, the tangible shit... They can't take what's on the inside, so you're special. Ooh, someone sees you as special. They see you fighting this conflict. This came out again, the Seven of Wands. This came... The Five of Wands and the Seven of Wands. You're fighting a lot of shit, single-handedly. You are single-handedly fighting off. You are alone doing this shit. No one's helping you do this. It's you and God against the world, boo. Male or female. It's you against... It's you and God against the world right now. This is nuts. Someone is admiring your strength, man. <laughs> I cannot get over this. I cannot. The energy of this masculine is... <sighs> man, he is all hot and bothered right now, man. Oh, man, I can feel it, man. This man is, like, dying right now. He's, like, itching to come towards you. He's, like, dying. And not itching in a, like, STD kind of way. Like, itching, like, man, he can't stand it anymore. Someone, this um, karmic masculine energy, this king of... Which, what was it? The king of wands in reverse. That's what I thought. So someone who wished they had a big wand. <laughs> who does not. Um, <laughs> that's that... What is that? The um, Leopold Barnate, Barna, Bonaparte um, syndrome. That little man syndrome. <laughs> someone who wished they had a big one caused a lot of conflicts for you they they were causing all kinds of trouble and they were working with someone behind the scenes to keep something hidden there's scorpio energy so scorpio could be involved and someone worked with someone to cause you a lot of shit man but this this other masculine he's <laughs> i can't oh my, okay i gotta say i just heard I want to stick it to you. I oh, he wants to stick it to you, feminine. Okay, and this um, King of Wands with Little Man Syndrome in the reverse. I gotta read it as I. Oh my god, I, I just read the energy, folks. Please don't blame me. I cannot help it. But this person wanted to stop you from getting an offer. I I don't make the rules, man. I don't. I don't. Don't shoot the messenger, please. If you got a little wee-wee, please don't be mad at me. I'm just reading the cards, and I'm not saying anything about it. You know, it's not its not the size of the ship, it's the motion of the ocean. And that is true, that is true. You know, it, it does have some truth to it. But man, someone wants to put their wand in a Divine Feminine, and it's a big wand. <laughs> and this is an official person. This is someone who is in the upright. Oh my gosh, this is a Hierophant energy. Wow. So this is this is an official person for real. They're serious. They're serious about this. Um, someone wanted this karmic energy. This um, <laughs> I got it. this little wee wee man. I can't help it, man. I cannot. This is just what's coming out. I I just read the energy. Please don't be mad at me. Wanted to stop you from moving forward. Didn't want you to be able to build. They wanted to stop you from moving on to calmer waters. But man, this this man has seriously got little man syndrome bad. This this king of wands in the reverse. Usually that's like a player energy, but this man can't play. This oh man, this person can't play. They wanted to weaken you. You know why they wanted to weaken you? Okay, we're just gonna dig. Just, just we're just gonna take a moment. They wanted to stop you from moving forward. They wanted to weaken you so that you had to go back to them because they wanted you dependent on them. But that's... It's that little man syndrome. They want control over you. They want you to, like, worship them. But they have nothing to worship. And I I mean that with, with the utmost respect. And I'm not dissing anyone's masculine size. I'm really not. Please don't be mad. 
<laughs> Please don't be mad. <laughs> you are starting a new cycle. Um, this King of Wands in reverse caused an imbalance for you, and you're going, you're going to get justice in a situation. Someone has made a decision to come towards you, and trust me, <laughs> it's a big decision. <laughs> there is a feminine energy who wanted you left out in the cold. This masculine energy that wants to come towards you is an emperor. He's in the upright. He's a mature male. He, this king of cups in the upright. He's got his shit in check. This, this is a balanced person. Um, you or your masculine or both of you could have divine gifts, okay? You could both be, I'm just being led to say, it, you both could be mirroring each other. If you both have divine gifts, um, you could have very similar qualities. Like, I'm just going to use this as an example. Like, if you're both card readers both of your readings could be almost mirroring each other but in different ways because you read differently but the same message comes out and i was led to say it so that's just what i'm going to say that's the example i was led to say but this karmic energy um something is over for them it's over some they tried to end you um and they told you they told lies about you this page of wands or no page of swords in reverse I'm so, I'm sorry. I am so stuck on that one thing. I'm just so blown away. Like, this reading feels so dirty. I can't help it. It just feels so dirty. <laughs> I'm not the most innocent person, but my god, it just feels so dirty. Someone lied about you to put an end to you. Someone wanted to end something before it even started. Oh, they're in their immature energy. This is an older person, but they're acting in a very immature way. This is that King of Wands energy in reverse. Man, they they really didn't want you to get your wand, man. Shame on them. That's a big thing to... <laughs> I... Oh, my God. I can't... I gotta... Oh. Okay, get it together. Get it together. Okay, I'm getting it together. We're, we're gonna get this together. All right. Okay. We're gonna get our shit together. You know what? I'm just gonna check these real quick. I'm struggling, man. I'm so distracted. <laughs> I am so distracted. Oh my gosh. This came out sideways. This fell on the floor. Two of cups, man. You have divine femme, divine masculine. You got something really good coming to you. You're about to be really, really happy. All I can say is you're going to be so happy, so, so happy. I feel like this masculine, whatever you've been through in the past, you're going to forget all about that. <laughs> you're not going to have time to think about anything else because this, this person wants to be with you in um, crazy kinds of ways. Not perverted, not twisted ways, but man, this... <sighs> have, you, have you all seen Magic Mike 2, the ending of that one? Um... Where that guy who plays like Al Seed from True Blood is on there with like the swing and stuff where he gets married. Yeah, it's that. It's that kind of energy. Oh my god. <clears throat> I I gotta get it together. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. This is just nuts. Someone wanted to stop you from celebrating. They didn't want you to get your wand. Your <laughs> King of Cups. This King of Cups is also um uh fairly well off king of pentacles this is like a businessman he's an official person he may own his own business oh my god i'm trying so hard i'm sorry something's gonna get it I'm, I'm trying i'm trying when i split the deck something's gonna go in your favor and somebody walked away from somebody so this king of pentacles king of cups this this wealthy um divine counterpart your divine male masculine how you know flip the rules as needed something's about to go in your favor because they're walking away from someone to come towards you they want you bad bad oh my gosh i can't even i can't someone wanted to cause you heartbreak or someone did cause you heartbreak <clears throat> there is a community or group of people coming together <clears throat> they see you're telling the truth. You're in your Queen of Swords energy. Um, you know, you're very um, head over heart right now. You're very focused. You're very logical. You're very balanced. You and your masculine are both balanced. You, you're mirroring each other. This is your divine counterpart. <clears throat> and let me tell you, you guys are going to make each other very, very happy. Someone didn't want you to have any options. That's why they left you out in the cold. Someone wanted you left out in the cold so you wouldn't have any options. But someone has been awakened. Someone has been enlightened. Someone got educated. Page of Swords. Someone knows what's going on. 
Oh man, some someone got woke. This is good news for you. This is really good news for you. <laughs> this <clears throat> this um, karmic energy wanted to keep you from getting any rest. This is I look at this in the upright. <clears throat> The Four of Swords is resting peacefully. Um, but this came out in the reverse. So the Four of Swords, someone didn't want you to be able to rest. They kept you busy. They kept you distracted. Um, they were just starting all kinds of fires so that you couldn't move forward like this. This person was just stupid for doing what they did. Because it's not stopping this divine counterpart. This masculine. One of y'all wants to... Yeah. Oh, gosh. Okay, so someone um, wanted you to be seen as a dime a dozen. They're only focused about the almighty dollar. Um, or, okay, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to look at this differently. So, someone who may appear as a dime a dozen. So, someone who just seems ordinary. Someone that you wouldn't expect to be financially well off. Someone that you wouldn't expect to be your di divine counterpart. Um... They're very wealthy. They're they're very well off, okay? But they don't advertise it to the world. Okay, so they kind of keep this hidden. They leave they live um within their means, if you know what I mean. Um a penny saved is a penny earned. So this karmic energy wanted you to look as if you were like a gold digger so that this masculine energy wouldn't come towards you. Um, because they have an axe to grind. Um yeah, and this wealthy person is, is like, really pissed off at this um, karmic energy for making them believe something that wasn't true. They heard something about you that was not true, and they believed it. Okay, so people that they trusted lied to them in a situation, and... Um, this, this well-off masculine energy, the one in the, the upright, has an axe to grind. They're pissed off. <clears throat> Meanwhile, back at <laughs> meanwhile back at the motel, <laughs> for any of you Ray Stevens fans, um, this karmic energy wants you to shut up. <laughs> they they want you to shut up. They want you to hold their tongue, hold your tongue, um, especially if you're talking about their little wee wee. I can't. Oh, I am trying. I'm trying. Okay, this person wanted you to be left licking your wounds, and they didn't want you to be seen as the stuff dreams are made of. They wanted to hit your self-esteem they wanted you to think really badly about yourself so that you oh man you know that thing where um and and this works for men and women too take it both ways but you know that thing where um you know people try to make their partner feel really bad about themselves so that they feel like that's as good as they're ever gonna get that's what this person was trying to do this person was trying to make you think that that was as good as it was going to get for you. But collective, the ones who are in the upright, the ones who are not karmics, just spying and, you know, looking for something to bitch about. For those who are in the upright, they saw through it. They're being woke. But somebody really wanted you to think that they were as good as it was going to get because they don't have much to offer somebody in the first place. Okay. <laughs> <clears throat> and I'm just going to say it because these, these came out on the top. Um, a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces could be involved. And also, um, one of them could be in hot water. So you and this karmic ex, <clears throat> and it doesn't have to be an ex, but this karmic um, ener masculine energy that's all up in your business trying to cock block you. Um, one of you or both of you could be a water sign. Okay. Take it how it resonates. Doesn't have to be. And it could be anywhere in your birth chart. Unless you know every person you've been with's birth chart. I mean, don't get all crazy with it, okay? And someone is not breathing a sigh of relief. Someone is like... <laughs> this karmic energy is like having a panic attack right now. What the hell? To add insult to injury, love is blind. Someone tried to keep you blind with like love bombing... Um, but to add insult to injury, this masculine is, like, blindly in love with you, like, 
they haven't even been with you. I'm I'm really strongly feeling the energy that maybe this new um, person, you haven't been with them before, but they're like head over heels in love with you and they want to give it to you something fierce. <laughs> oh my God. And this is adding insult to injury for that karmic energy who is trying to cock block you. What a dick. Uh, and I don't mean that literally because they don't have one and i seriously don't mean that with disrespect but at the same time you know they're karmic so it is what it is you know they take the diss as they you know as required a libra could be involved someone's hitting the panic button someone wanted you to be panicking um like i said they wanted you to be um running to them they wanted you to think that they were the best that you could get and it's just really adding insult to injury that this, this new masculine has everything that, you know, basically your dream come true, your wish fulfillment, and they didn't want you to get that. They wanted you to settle for the bullshit that they had. This is like the Ren and Stimpy in the shitty litter box. Someone wanted control over you, and they wanted you stuck in that shitty situation, you know? <laughs> oh my gosh. This karmic energy was barking up the wrong tree. You see the writing on the wall. You're smart. You're intelligent. And so is this masculine and the upright. You and your divine counterpart, both of you, um, are on the same page, even if you don't know it. Like, both of you are just... You're ready to roll, man. All right, I'm going to get a couple of these real quick. If anything comes out, this has gotten a little crazy. I didn't mean to be so dirty, I really didn't. This this masculine in the upright thinks you're larger than life. And they're going to be breaking the silence soon. This came out sideways. So uh, this is like current or very near future energy. So this person, your divine counterpart, is going to be breaking the silence very soon. Call me a little sunshine. They literally see you as their little sunshine. They They are so in love with you. They admire everything about you. These this karmic dick, man, the one who was trying to see block you, uh, they wanted you to settle for the false twin flame, but man, your, your true divine counterpart just adores you, adores you, like the little sunshine, they love you. You have somebody all up in their head, stayed in my head, you have someone all up in their head. And this karmic energy is left thinking, what happened because they chose someone else over you stupid girl in the reverse so this king of wands this player energy in the reverse chose someone over you and meanwhile you have this other masculine who just can't get you out of their head they're in total awe of you okay all right i'm gonna pull just a few letters some people have been complaining that you know um that they haven't seen their sign or you know letters that resonate so i'm just gonna go ahead and pull I'm, I'm gonna pull five letters so the letter u could be significant and this could be in anyone's name it could be a place person place or thing just think of it as a noun it could be significant in any way don't shoot me i just pulled the letters okay the letter a could be significant The letter B could be significant. The letter M could be significant. All right, last one. Let's dig in there deep. And the letter J could be significant. Okay, folks, um, we're going to end it here, but um, man. <laughs> I just got to say this real quick. So B, A, and M came out. Man, someone wants to give you the bam, bam. I can't, I, I'm sorry. It's just what it is, you know. But someone wants to give you that bam, bam. I hope this helps, folks. This was a good one. This was good. I hope you all have a good night. <laughs> As always, do everything with a cup of love, cup of wisdom. And some of you guys are going to be very, very happy in the near future, okay? Um... Good luck, man. Rest up. You're going to you're going to be tired out soon, right? <laughs>